What's shaking, Ponzi? This ain't just a social call, is it? I'm afraid not. I'm relieved to see you, sir. The Soviets appear to be up to some mischief. What kind of mischief are we talking about? Because uh, if she says she's 18, you can't just call her a liar. No, no. The Soviet ambassador is throwing a party for the opening of an exhibit of Russian modern art. Frankly, it's making me a bit nervous. A number of Albion's VIPs are in attendance. You know, I'm starting to worry about you, Ponzi. You're getting a twitch. What exactly is it you're scared's gonna happen? I don't know. That's what's worrying me. Mainly, I'm worried about all those VIPs. MPs, captains of industry, all gathered in one place. It's a disaster waiting to happen. Thank God I managed to dissuade Her Majesty from attending. That could have been a real cluster of, um... Ouch. My virgin ears. So, what? You want me to get over there, rough the ambassador up a little? Dear Lord, no. I just need you to mingle with the crowd and check it out. Incognito, as it were. Okay, I'll get a disguise. Wouldn't want my pretty mug to ruin anybody's appetite. So, modern art, huh? Jackson Pollock pees on a canvas and sells it for 50 grand. I don't get it. Ha! <laughs> oh, you're serious? Well, I suppose it takes something of an educated eye to make sense of it. Educated eye? What a crock! I don't need a master's in art history to know what I like. No, no, of course not. But as modern art has become more abstracted, it helps to understand the conceptual framework the artist had in mind. You realize the player's in the kitchen making nachos at this point, right? Well, you did that whole Blue Rider thing in the first game. I, I just thought perhaps... I know, I know. Lead Balloon City. What are you gonna do? Okie dokie, Smokey. I'll go grab a disguise and mingle with the in crowd. Excellent. I'll stay in radio contact in case you need me. people about now, is it? Fine. Oh. 
shall be done, her lord. I may need another pair of knickers. Why? Yes, Why, I never... Oh, good heavens, my head! Your wish is my command. Right, that gives us a room to be quite a price. Crack the statue of the one that and let's have a look inside. Oh, very strong. Shall we see what's inside this one? Oh, that statue is big enough to hide an atom bomb! Or worse! I must see what's inside it. Shoot the humans all you want, spaceman, but you're only treating the symptoms. You want to get the disease, you have to shoot the spores. Let's throw ya! Thanks, Cupcake. Always nice to meet a chick who can handle her guns. You got a name? The name is Natalia. I'm here to help you, Spaceman. Or do you prefer Mr. President? Mr. What the? Does everybody on this dismal freaking island know who I am? Da, pretty much. At least everyone in my line of work. Oh. So you work for Ponsonby? Yet. Although after this little incident, I may have to ask him for a job. I work for the Komatet Gosu Darstvenoi Bezupeznosti. Why, you make pasta? I'm a secret agent with the KGB. So you're a secret agent, huh? Cause I got a package that needs delivering. Your eyes only. Big. I have three knives hidden on my body, and I'm blindingly lethal with all of them. Now concentrate. Ooh, I think I'm in love. The KGB? Are you yanking me? Oh, for crying out loud. You're not gonna try to assassinate me, are you? Cause I'm a little winded. I could use a second. Don't be ridiculous. The fact is, I'm not very popular in Moscow at the moment. I'm as patriotic as the next coldly beautiful Russian female, but... something's changed in the Kremlin. It's hard to put a finger on. All I know is, I can't just stand by and follow orders anymore. I guess you could say I've... gone rogue. Hmm. What the hell do you think was in those statues? Hard to say. It's listed in official documents as Golshnyevkro. Sounds tasty. Mmm. 
It loosely translates as either an incredibly lethal biological weapon or a quasi-legal performance enhancer for the Soviet Olympic team, depending on the context. Why the hell would you turn your back on your own species to hook up with an alien invader from outer space? First, we are not hooking up. And second, why would I trust a Furon over a KGB apparatchik? Because everything's gone bizumnye. The Politburo spitting out orders that don't make any sense. My colleagues transforming into irradiated monsters. All hell is breaking loose. Something's happening. Something very, very wrong. And I think I'm the only person on Earth who knows it. But not anymore. Eh, Tovarish? So, what is it? Some kind of mutagen? Cause I don't know what mutants are supposed to look like, but... Actually, no. It's a spore. It infects a host through inhalation or skin contact. But, after a brief incubation period, it seems to set about genetically rebuilding the victim into something... not human. You think somebody engineered it for the purpose? You have a better explanation? I'm just trying to put all the pieces together. At first, I thought it was being made here, but now I'm not so sure. Pochomoy! The schedule's been moved up. They're about to shower these abominable spores all over the city. You take the Hyde Park infestation. I'll handle the ones in Soho. And Spaceman, good hunting, huh? She's right. You must hurry to Hyde Park and kill all infected humans at once. We mustn't allow this parasite to spread. My men have marked locations for four similar statues in Hyde Park. These should be your first port of call.
Basement. I'll be in touch. Mit Wahnsinn.